So you might be able to guess what kind of shop this is. This is like Garo. Honey shop. He has red. You can see him, he doesn't care at all. He doesn't care at all. He has a nice little one kg. Any shop. He's getting the red honey out of a big 10 gallon, 5 gallon oil cooking oil can. It's very cool. In some of these trees, they have the traditional honey hives that they put. They hollow a log and then use uh, uh, plant material straps they put around it. They weave an end to it and somebody climbs those trees all the way up and puts the honey up at the top. In fact, there's one right there, but you really can't see it. It's hard to see. And uh, I wouldn't want to be the person that climbs, climbs a tree and tries to bring down a hive of African honeybees. That would not be fun, but So this is what the hive structure looks like. And it's just like a hollow log inside, pretty much nothing. And then bound up with a probably banana. This is an old one. And if you look right there, there's one in the tree. Right there. So someone's got to do a heck of a climb. Do you know how do they bring down the the hive to to collect the honey? To collect, uh, they go through the bees. Uh huh. And they pick they pick a honey from from them. Yeah. Do they use? How do they make the bees they go away? Smoke. Uh, yeah, they, they use some smoke, fire. Okay. Uh, fire. Uh -huh. and they also, when they get up, they use the rope. You know rope? Yeah. Yeah, they use rope, and also they have the fire. Yeah. The smoke, you know. But it's it's still a little dangerous if the bees come. <laughs> yeah, it's very d dangerous. Yeah, in but the they, tree. They have experience when they get up. Yeah. Yeah, I, I have bees at my home. Okay. I, I'm a beekeeper. You, okay. you say beekeeper. Okay, you are the beekeeper? Yeah, I have too, but it's it's not like this. Yeah. Okay, you have a, like a, a box. Which in box. Is, uh, yeah, with okay. the screens in okay. the box. So, okay. yeah. Maybe we go. <laughs> Sometimes, yeah, yeah. It's but, a very good way that we... Yeah. Just beautiful here, and it's harvest time. Not not too difficult. <laughs> really good. Okay, well this is a little funny because we were looking at the traditional honey uh, 
in, in, in logs that are bound together and put in the trees. And right up there I even see one, right, uh, where is it, right there, right there, but they, they do it our style too. Not our style, but a commercial style. I'm sort of surprised to see this. Uh, these are a style of box I don't really know. These supers, but they even have metal lids. But they seem to be blocked. The entrances look locked so I wonder what they're doing here very odd uh, there's a little I'm actually a little bit scared of full African honeybees and probably rightly so yeah this is a uh... No activity here. Yeah. yeah, it looks like they had a sort of limited entrance there to prevent raiding and uh, yeah, it's got typical Looks like they have a feeder and screens, and they're foundationless. I can see. Yeah, they're foundationless. Well, I can't do this. Hello. So pretty interesting. But they clearly don't want the... We tried, but... Ah. So this is your project? Yeah. You, this is your project? Yes, we are planning to... Yeah. Uh, so yeah, this is nice. Any part? These are... Oh, can you, can you lift this a second? Let me see. So this is foundationless. Yeah. Okay. So what do you call this? That's not good. Huh? Briz. Briz. Yes. Briz. And in Briz. Oramifa? Honey with water. Oil. Honey and water. I do this all the time when I get honey, I mix it. That's why you. So it's local Gera honey? Yes. 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 Okay. Wow. Fish on the Kabunikov. Yeah. Wow. It's so so, I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go to the